It's fantastic to be back in Sydney, um, you know, Cronulla Beach, such an iconic surfing location. I guess you kind of get carried away in a, in a sense of travelling the world on an elite level tour and then, but when you always come home, you know, it's coming home to you, your family and friends and where you started from and I think being able to compete alongside them again in your local town, your local area and, and then bring it to a stage like the board riders battle here in Cronulla and, you know, make our club the best club in Australia. Surfing as an individual, you're just obviously serving for yourself and but surfing for a club like Snapper, you come here, you're serving for your other team members that are there with you on the day, but you also serve for all the people back home and the people at the surf club watching on, so it's, a, it's pretty tough, but it's fun at the same time. The purpose of the original Source Australian Board Riders Battle is really to build the profile and to build the capacity of Board Riders Clubs, and you know, the last three years of this program has seen some outstanding results in, in that space. I've been in the club most of my life, we're 38 years old and in the last two years that this contest has been here, it's boosted our grommets by about 15%. You know, we've injected over $260,000 in prize money in the last uh, three years into board riders clubs and you know, this year we're, we're offering 110,000 prize money so we'll be furthering that investment into clubs. Yeah, we're really proud to be working with Surfing Australia and really to be supporting grassroots surfing and, and the spirit of the board riders clubs and we feel like the intensity the event brings really aligns well to our brand. Oh, the finals are just electric. I think the competitive spirit that the teams have and the real intense battle that plays out on the day uh, is just a fantastic experience to be part of and, and you really feel that on the beach and through the coverage. We're going to have something like 500 domestic and international visitors here over the Australia Day weekend and about a quarter of a million people watching Cronulla uh, live on Fox Sports. I think Snapper always had a target, you know, we had a pretty solid team. I think we have a little format change coming up this year and I think it's going to be really hard to, to try and back it up a third time but um, our team will submit will be pretty, pretty, uh, pretty confident in that team.